Good morning! Today I am doing my second Crazy Factory haul. I have two different orders and together I have 12 different end pieces for my lip labrets. And I will be trying them all on in this video. I also got some new earrings to replace the Bioflex ones that I tried on. This time I got both ear pieces in metal. So first I got the same one as I had in my previous video, if you watched that. Which is this tiny jewel. And this one is internally threaded. But I also got the ones that I'm wearing now, which I think I prefer. It's the same kind of jewel, but these are on a ball end. So they seem a bit bigger. And I really like them. I also decided to get a few new Labret bars, because I think the one that I'm wearing now is actually a bit big on me. If you watched my previous video, you might have noticed that I already changed it to a shorter one. But I decided to put my old one in, so that you can see that it's too big, and I'll show you close up. So you can actually see some of the bar poking out, and you can tell that the ball isn't flat against my skin. So I do think it's a little bit too long. This is 8mm length. So I did order one in 7 and one in 6 millimeters just to try out. So here are all the end pieces and bars and I also got the same sticker again, twice. So I'm slightly building up a collection. So this is a Bioflex in 7 millimeters, and this is the one I'll be wearing so I'm just gonna put this in now. You can see that this one isn't poking out as much. It's almost level with my skin. But if I push it there is some extra space. In my first order, I bought four different push fit end pieces. The first end piece I'm gonna show you is the same crystal as I had in the first ear piece, and the same one as I tried on in my previous video, but I just wanted to try it on this shorter bar to see if it looks better. So there's the crystal, it also has like a metal circle around it, kind of like a frame. And if you look on it sideways, you can see that it's kind of pyramid shape, which I don't really like. I wish that it was flat, like a disc. So this is that one, it's called Aurora Boralis. It's like a white crystal, but then it has pink, purple, green and some blue shine to it when the light hits it. And this is just 3 millimeters. so very small and cute. This next one is the same jewel, and it's also supposed to be the same size, 3 millimeters. But this one seems bigger just because it doesn't have the metal circle around it. And I bought this one because I was hoping that this one was flat on the backside. It's really hard to tell from the online website because they don't have a lot of pictures of the end pieces. So there's no way to tell really other than to buy it and see for yourself. But this one is also kind of pyramid shaped. That's what it looks like. Since it doesn't have the metal ring around it, I think it looks more like a 4mm. This next one I bought with a bar because I thought it would be nice to have a backup. But I got this in 8mm and now that I can wear the 7mm I probably won't wear this anymore. But the end piece is a nice green crystal. Peridot or Peridot, which is actually my birthstone color, if you care about shit like that. This is the green. Also 3mm. And then lastly, I got a plain metal half disc. It's kind of like the circular ball, but it's flat. And this one is actually flat on the back side as well, which is nice. And this is also still 3 millimeters. It looks really small in my opinion. And since it's flat, you can kind of barely see it. So that was all the push fit end pieces that I got. And I was kind of sad because there aren't a lot of end pieces for Bioflex jewelry because they have to be push fit. But then I learned that there are converters out there. So I placed an order at Body Art Forms and it came in this small package. I also got this card with gauge measurements on the backside and then this awesome sticker with their logo. And I got two converters just in case I lose one. So on one end, they are like a push fit, so they fit into my Bioflex Labret. But on the other end, there is a screw part. And so I ordered eight more end pieces from Crazy Factory. So I'm just gonna put on one converter and then I'll try those on. 
there's just a screw part sticking out, which means that I now can fit on any kind of externally threaded end pieces, which is awesome. I do prefer the small ones, but I also wanted to try some bigger ones just to see what it looks like. And I got a bunch of different sizes, and some of the ones I bought didn't even have the size on the website. So I just took a chance and bought them. So I'm gonna start it with the smaller ones and then I'll work my way up to the bigger ones. So I have end pieces from 4mm and all the way up to 8mm. This first piece is a circular ball. It's silver color on the back side and sides, but it's white enamel, I think, on the front. So this is the white ball. I actually really like it. I don't like that it's a circular ball because, as I said, I really like flat discs. Because I don't really like have balls kind of poke out of your skin, kind of, if you know what I mean. They kind of protrude too much for my taste. But when they're small like this, uh, it doesn't bother me as much. This next one is a circular ball with a spike on the end. And this is also 4mm. But sadly, I can't wear this because, again, there weren't a lot of pictures of this online so you couldn't see where the hole was but I thought it would fit on my labret like this so that it would have the hole on the side but it's threaded on the top so that it pokes straight out and I personally don't like that look so I won't be wearing this but I'll try it on anyways just to show you so yeah I really wish that this one pointed downwards instead the next two looked really similar on the webpage, but again the size didn't say, so one turned out to be bigger than the other. So this is the smaller one, which I think is also 4mm. It's a silver ball, but then it has these jagged lines around it. Looks like this. I don't know if you can even tell that there's the jagged lines on there. This is the second one, which is slightly bigger, and instead of jagged lines, it has kind of smaller circles that go around it. And if I were to guess, I would say that this is like a 5mm. The next one I got on a 6mm metal bar, because I wanted to see if I could wear metal ones if it was really short. And it did fit, but it still would sometimes hit my teeth. I don't want to risk my teeth, so I will still wear the 7mm Bioflex instead. And this one has like a bunch of circular balls with a spike in the middle. And I'm not too sure on this, but I just thought it looked fun and I just wanted to try it on. There it is. I don't really think this is my style, but it's kind of fun to try on. Most likely I won't wear it, but I haven't really decided yet. And this one was 6mm wide. Then I have a 6mm circular ball again, but with a cat eye pearl in light pink. And again, I just really wish that this was a flat disc instead of a ball, because I'm not sure if I want to wear this, because I just think it protrudes too much. But I just really like the pearl. This is the pink one. Not sure you can tell from this far away. I think it looks really cute from the front, but I just don't like how it looks from the side. It's just too much metal. And then finally I was able to find a completely flat disc, but it's kind of a slightly boring design. It's just solid metal color, but it does have a spiral design on the front. And I think this is my favorite one, even though it isn't like a shiny pearl or jewel. But I think plain metal is great for everyday wear. And I thought the 6mm was gonna be a bit big on me, but I actually really like this size. I've always liked people that have their uh, like lower labret stretched. And I kind of feel that with some bigger discs like this, you kind of get that look without having it stretched. And I just love how flat it is. On my skin. Yes, discs all the way. And the last piece is also a disc, silver on the side 
with a dark green enamel on the front. I thought it looked a bit more interesting on the online photo. The enamel didn't look as dull, it kind of looked more shiny. It definitely looked even more dark in the photo. This is the green disc. And I do think 8mm is a bit big for my face, but I just wanted to try it on for fun. Again, it kind of gives you that look of a stretch labyrinth, I think. I do kind of like it, but I'm just a bit wary of actually wearing it. But maybe it's because I'm not used to such big jewelry. And there's something about the feel of this that I really like. I don't know if it's the weight or the size or the fact that it, there's a lot of metal touching the skin. But it just feels really nice on my lip. <laughs> so that was finally all the pieces that I got. Please leave me a comment down below which piece you like the best. And then I hope to see you in my next video. Peace